Hello, everybody. I'm Jay Lynn, and welcome to episode 15.5 of my Minecraft Survival World. And doing things a little bit different today. This is essentially just a quick little upload here to check in, say hello. I know it's been a little while since my last episode, and that's because I need a little break, took a little break through the holidays and a little while after, but starting to get the itch here again, and I got a project in mind that's separate from this world that I know might take a little while, so I just wanted to check in, let you know I'm still around, so I thought I'd make a little montage of me doing some chores. But first, we're going to head back to where we ended last episode, which was trying to find a zombie villager, which we ended up finding one here. And give him his medicine here. There he is, all cured up. Got a lectern in there, so he turned into a librarian right away. And then started the fun game of breaking the lectern to change his trades. And he wasn't even giving me book trades for the first few. It was kind of annoying. And the first book trade he gave me, nothing too special, respiration. But the second book trade he gave me, probably about five times breaking the lectern. And we got mending for one emerald. I was super pumped. Usually this takes a very long time, and I've never had mending for one emerald. So that was really cool. I had some books handy. Went ahead and traded for some mending books to bring back to the base with me. I went ahead and broke these and traded these books as well. Missed the camera shot of it, but before we went back, we went ahead and hunted some phantoms since they were out for us staying out looking for zombies. This way, just to get us some of the membranes to fix our wings all the way, even before we put mending on. So, we got putting mending on some of the vital tools and armor until we ran out of levels, but. Got a nice little start on things. And it's nice to have mending, so it's going to be real cool having a full set of armor and tools with mending on it. But yeah, with this episode, I thought it'd be kind of fun just to do a little experiment of a nice, relaxing montage of me just doing my chores that I would usually do off camera. Kind of in the style of a long play, but it doesn't end up being very long. And yeah, I also wanted to mention it might be a moment between episodes here again. Hopefully not as long as it's been right now, but not because I won't be playing. I just I do have plans to get a, another type of video going that is going to take a little bit of time. So I'm looking forward to getting that out and I'm going to leave it as a surprise for you. But it does it is going to take some time. But I'll be working on this world alongside all the way through. And yeah, as I release different types of videos in different worlds and whatever, I really hope to keep this world as long as my channel lives. This will be my forever world. I will start new worlds and I will do different things, but this will be the one that I always end up going back to. So yeah, from here I'm just going to kind of step back and let you sit back, relax, enjoy a little gathering, and do, do a little organizing of my chests in the end, and I'll come back at the end, and we'll kind of just get an idea for what our inventory is looking like at this point in the season, but for now, just kind of sit back, relax, and enjoy some Minecraft sounds. I know I like videos like that, so I'm just curious if anybody else is in anything like that, like this, so I'll be back in a few minutes. Or I guess I should say a few songs.
pop in to point out that I cleared this area out over here where the skeleton spawner is so that I've got a nice blank slate for when I work on a project that I've got planned for that. And we've got our wood chest nice and filled up at this point, which is feeling pretty good. But it's still a little more chopping, and for this I am clearing out my path for the road towards the where I'm going to have a base at the jungle mountain area. So that's what's heading out this direction. So I just went along and cut the, whatever trees were in my way. Feeling pretty good about my wood stock at this point. And the last thing we're gonna do here is go around and consolidate all of our just random chests that we have sitting around at old projects and kind of centralize a lot of our inventory. And then in the end, I'll go around and show you kind of where we're standing. So that was actually a pretty big project, but it does feel good to have all my random chests kind of cleaned up and have a better idea where we stand with our inventory and stuff. Like you saw, we got a nice full chest of wood here. And I got this one cleared up for the most part. I was mainly transferring things down to the mine area. That's going to be kind of my main storage for now. But yeah, I got a few boxes with just some random stuff. And I won't show you all those. As far as building materials go, we're not looking quite as good as I might have thought, I'll be honest. Not horrible, but I would have thought it would have been a little better stock. But decent amount of leaves. Mining-wise, we're looking horrible. I barely have any iron, so I'm going to need to do something about that. But yeah, just working on getting things kind of transferred down to the mine area because it's more centralized. So, so yeah, I thought I had a little more raw materials here. We got decent amount of cobblestone and stone but I thought if I put all my chests together I would have had more wish I had more deep slate as well we're doing decent on dirt I got another full chest over at the other base sand I barely have any of I need to get a whole bunch of sand same for gravel because I had a fortune shovel to start the season so that's annoying not too great on mud or terracotta gonna need to do a little trip there but we got a starting point and decent amount of the stone variants but yeah, I, I would have thought things would have added up to be a little more than where they are, but we're not horrible by any means. But I would say for as long as I've been in this world, I usually have a lot more stuff stacked up. But that just shows that I've really been hitting the building hard and using it as soon as I get it. And we do have a few more things up in the house up here. Not too much. These are just kind of random chests to keep things organized, but we do have a nice pile of dirt over here, so I'm doing pretty decent on the dirt for some terraforming. And also over here we have 
a whole bunch more wood and our main stock of birch wood. So we're doing good on wood for the moment and leaves. We've got a bunch of leaves here, so. But with that, we're actually gonna call it an episode here. I know it wasn't much. Again, it was mainly just me to say hello, remind you that I'm still here. I know it's been a while between videos and it might be a little while before the next one. It's a big project I'm working on and got a decent little start, but it's gonna take some work and you'll understand when you see it, so. Yeah, thanks again for coming and hope you all have a good day.